every family is unique and so are their needs for family-friendly transportation. I get that budget is a big factor too, which got me thinking, what kind of a list could I put together of my favorite family haulers on the market for under 50 grand that caters to all kinds of needs? Sure, an eight-seater SUV is great, but it's probably overkill for a family of three. And the same goes with something a little smaller, which is perfectly fine for your nuclear family most of the time, but it probably doesn't make sense if you're shuttling the kids to hockey practice a couple days a week. And that's why this list has a little something for everyone from a tiny crossover to the most practical kind of people mover there is. Since it's here with me, let's start with the overhauled Toyota Sienna. First of all, it's a hybrid now, which means it burns less gas than a Corolla, but there's enough room inside for your kids' entire Christmas choir. Beyond all the outright space, it's incredibly usable with more storage than a Tupperware party and all kinds of flexibility for passengers. You can't get a Sienna as loaded with features as this one for 50 grand, but you can get a lot of what you see here for the money, including this big touchscreen, all kinds of advanced safety systems, and even optional all-wheel drive. The Rogue isn't the most popular SUV this size, but Nissan has done a great job making this new version a legitimate contender in the segment, and not just based on the price anymore. The base trim isn't bad, but it's up above the $30,000 mark that you start to see the stuff that really sets it apart. Built-in Wi-Fi will keep the kids happy on road trips, and it just might have the best adaptive cruise control on the mainstream market. It's not quite as roomy as a segment leader like the Honda CRV, but it has way more features to set it apart, and there's more than enough space inside for a family of four and its stuff. Oh, and the most expensive one barely tops 40 grand before tax. There's not much separating all the three row SUVs out there these days, but the Palisade earns a spot on this list because all the stuff it does just right. Just like the Sienna, you don't need to shell out for the top trim to get a lot of good stuff. And for about 48,000 bucks before tax, the Palisade Preferred has just about everything you could ask for. You get all kinds of good safety stuff, heated seats front and back, wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto connections, all wheel drive, and the list goes on. It also doesn't hurt that it's almost as spacious as some of the biggest entries in the segment. Take it from a former Outback owner, pound for pound, this is the reigning versatility champ for its size. It's not quite as tall as something like the Rogue or the Toyota RAV4, but there's just as much space for people and stuff inside. Plus, you're driving something that doesn't look like what's parked in every one of your neighbor's driveways. And since it's not a wagon, even though it is, it's got full-time all-wheel drive and more ground clearance than the RAV4 and most SUVs like it. On top of that, there's all kinds of advanced safety stuff in every trim, which means you're getting plenty of peace of mind for its pre-tax price range of about 33 to 46 grand. If you don't need as much room as a Rogue or an Outback, it's hard for me to recommend any little crossover other than the Seltos. Don't get me wrong, there are some excellent options on the market, but none of them are as all-encompassing as this new entry. I'm gonna suggest you step all the way up to the SX Turbo trim if you can, but that barely touches 35,000 bucks before tax, and it gives you a lot of crossover for the money. First, there's all the space inside. A family of three or four could easily use this without many complaints. Obviously, all that room is included no matter which trim you get, but the top one comes decked out with everything imaginable, from heated and ventilated front seats to heated rear seats, a head-up display, and a fantastic little turbo motor. The list goes on and on. But even if you stick with a cheaper trim, you get stuff like lane keep assist, blind spot monitoring, and auto emergency braking for 30 grand before tax. So there you have it, my five favorite family haulers for less than 50 grand. And there are lots of other great options out there too, but whether you need room for a young family of three or you want all the space that comes with seating for seven, the ones on this list aren't a bad place to start.